but it's all we needed just for last night um so like i say it's half six our flights at like five to ten um check-in and bag drop open three hours before the flight so we're just gonna head down i think we're heading down about seven o'clock to go and do that yeah i'm sorry i'm just so tired so so tired i don't really know how Sorry, I didn't want to really be rude and be on on camera. Um, I've, I've only ever flown from Heathrow once and it was years ago. So I don't really know what there is, but I'll take you with us. I'll show you everything. We'll get on the flight. I'll try to show you as much on the flight as possible. Um, so myself and Mike have actually booked two end seats next to each other. So there'll be me, I'll, Mike. Um, we did this last year when we went to Paris and we just found it was easier when we came to getting off the flight and we didn't have to move the people going to the toilet. It, we just, we enjoyed it that way. So that's what we've booked. So I might not be able to do much vlogging on the flight. I'll obviously take photos and videos of in-flight entertainment, meals and everything like that. Um, and then I might do a voiceover. I'm not too sure yet how it's going to work, but we'll sort it. So, I don't know what to do right now, I'm so tired. So let's just start getting ready and let's go to Japan. Japan Airlines pipe draw, here we go. We've done it, we've dropped our bags. So we're just heading heading up to departures now. Oh, can you get up there? Yeah. yeah. We're just trying to get up to security now. Oh, sorry, Mike. And then go through security. And then get maybe some food, a drink. Have a look at the books. Finally through security. It didn't take too long, but the people in front of us were faffing around. Like, you know, you're coming through security, just sort yourself out. Hold Anyway. So we're in duty free. I could do with looking for a pair of earrings, considering flushed one of mine down the sink. I know it's on me, it's such a stupid thing to do. So I could do with finding some earrings because otherwise my ears will close up. And then I might have a look at books. Although I've said I'm not buying any unless unless there's fourth wing in paperback. You know, you know. Let's have a look and see. See what there is. This is huge. fourth wing in paperback, I'd buy it. <laughs> secured the earrings, secured the book. Um, oh, we've just been to prep. I've got a cranberry, raspberry and pomegranate juice. What did you get? A vanilla latte. Classic vanilla latte. Classic vanilla latte. Classic Michael Bell that is. And a chocolate croissant. So we're just going to sit and wait to board, aren't we? Yep. How long we got? About 40 minutes until the gate 
Oh, until the gate comes up. But it was longer than that. And then a possibility of a 20 minute walk to the gate. <laughs> I feel like when we went away last year, the walk to the gate in Manchester was pretty long. Well, it said it was like 25 minutes or 20 minutes or something like that, and it only took us like five minutes. Yeah. So I don't know, like, who, who's walking there? No. But yeah, so we'll see you when we get on the flight. Oh, probably when we get to the desk. I'll show you the flight. I'll show you the plane. What am I on about? I'm too tired, it's too early. <laughs> Here's our plane. Can't believe it. Can't actually believe it's there. We're boarding! We're finally going! <laughs> Let's go! Announcement that's just going constantly, and I hope Mike always up. <laughs> we made it! 
Mike's exhausted. Right, now we've got to figure out how to get the train or bus. What is it? Okay, we'll have a look. So we're just waiting on our first train. Mon. What's the The trains out there. Hmm? The trains out there. Oh, yeah. Anyway, we're getting the money. Did you see the vending machine? It's all packed. No, to be honest, I'm oh. too tired. To oh, mm. oh, the vending machine over there. That one had Pikachu on it. Oh. <laughs> it's a bit hectic at the minute. I mean, we've got like three, three cases, so I'll probably catch up with you when we're at the hotel. <laughs> Just dropped off our bags and now we're off to the first convenience store of the trip. First of many, isn't it, Mike? And see some extra to drink and maybe a snack. Talk us through what you got. What did you actually pick up? Strawberry. Not a clue. It looks like a bread roll with icing on. No, it's not icing. Oh. It's just like pink food coloring on top. It's and like you drink. Cream, what it? drink did you get? Match, 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 match. This is rank. Is it really bad? Yeah. Oh, well, I've just had a sip of this lemon. It's like sparkling water but with no lemon flavour and I got a melon pan so let's see what the melon pan's like I can confirm the melon pan is really good do I taste it? Mm. it tastes like something but I can't think what mm. Mm -hmm. having his first drink of match match Too sweet. No. Really good. <laughs> We're just waiting for our train. We're heading over to Team Lab Planet. So we've got massive bags under my eyes. I'm really tired. Mike's incredibly tired. Mike didn't sleep at all on the plane. So we booked Team Lab Planets just to keep us awake really today and then head back, maybe get some food before. And then early night, early night, very early night, very early night. Just gone into hour 20, being awake and It'll be fine. Just stumbled upon our first sighting of. We think this is plum, don't we? We think this is plum blossom. I have no idea. You, you don't. Me, I, think. I think it is. Only because I've seen online that cherry blossoms not till end of March. So I think this is plum blossom. But we've stumbled upon this like. We're waiting for our timed entry to go into Team Lab Plants, which is over there. We've stumbled upon this little park, haven't we? Now you've said that you saw an ice cream van and it turned out to not be an ice cream van. I kind of want an ice cream. Well, I, I I'm one of them vans over there has got to be ice cream. 90% chance one of them over there is ice cream. Okay, let's go. How nice it is. Here we are. Team Lab Planet. Got my loose fitted trousers on so I can roll oh, them up. Check the... We're in. Please stop at a footprint in front of you. There's a footprint. You're not on one. <laughs> oh, I'm so tired. I'm so tired. We both said on the way here, we're that tired. 
we think it might feel like we're tripping. Oh, what's that? We both said didn't really, we were about tired, but might feel like we're tripping a bit. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well. Just, isn't it like a pillow room or something? I might just go yeah, and sleep. there is. We're, we're just going to collapse. Oh, I'm going to have to run through it. <laughs> oh, just run through and break an ankle. <laughs> different types of orchids and they're real. I, every time I've seen them online I thought they were fake. It smells like so floral but not overpowering considering how many flowers are in here. So cool. Finished. A little, it was quite a cute little activity to do just for our it first was, day. Yeah. We've only been there yeah we've been round twice so they don't stop you from going round more than once to be fair um, and we wanted to go back and see if we'd missed anything which we had missed that bit in the water room yeah there was well there was in the infinity light room as well oh the yeah we found them there. corner bits in there so yeah it was good I think we rushed it a little bit for the first time yeah we were just too yeah. excited I think well, not excited but just interested to see what was next yeah. but I loved the flower room, flower room was and the light room. room. Yeah. You liked the water room, didn't you? I did like the water room. Yeah. yeah a lot smaller than I thought it was, but then yeah. to be fair, I actually I don't think I expected it to be any bigger because I know all I've seen all those rooms on TikTok and stuff. Mm. Yeah. yeah well, good though. Worth doing. Definitely worth, worth doing. doing but it wasn't exactly much, was it? No, each. If you're just going to go around once, then yeah. you probably need about half an hour to 40 minutes. Yeah, you don't need long. We booked half one and it was quite quiet. Yeah. When we came off the tube earlier, it was half 11. And yeah. they were queued like zigzag behind us over there. Yeah, whereas we literally sat on them benches there and then walked in and just wandered around. There was people in there, like it wasn't quiet, but it wasn't absolutely rammed. No, it was a good. It was a good amount. So yeah, definitely would recommend. Just need to figure out what we're going to do next now. I mean, we are both pretty tired, but it. Very bit, very tired. It's a bit early. What? Oh, kimono. It's cute. Oh, there she is. 
Um, yes, yeah, so we just need to figure out what we're going to do next. We were going to, when we came out of there, because we thought it would be like one to two hours, we were going to then go to Macca's. Yeah, we were then going to go to Macca's and then go back. Oh, we can't check in yet. Oh, we will by the time we get back. Um, I don't know. I honestly don't know. Yeah, see where we end up. Oh my God, my hair. Fluffy. So we've made it to Small Worlds. I think it's like a miniature, oh, what were they called? Do we have them in England? But it's like a miniature village. No, it's actually got a name. I don't know, but anyway, let's go and have a look. <laughs> what you spotted? Galleria is the space centre. Oh, we've got a map. Are they little cat? Oh no, they've gone. Oh. therapeutic place I think I've ever been to. You just go around touching buttons, making stuff do stuff. Don't know why that's done. Oh, that thing. I don't know what I've just... I've pressed this one and I don't think it did anything. What well, is that one of your dinosaurs? Mike's actually doing the dinosaur challenge that the woman gave us. There's one on there. You got me into it now, for God's sake. Oh, there's a turtle with a big building on its back. Dragon! We can make the dragon do something. Oh. Only in Tokyo would you find somewhere like this. Finally sat after the Small World Museum. It's all right, wasn't it? Yeah. Interesting. We got over quickly, but we've both hit a wall, so we've come for some food. And for something so super easy, it's something we always like to try in different countries. Mike's gone for the teriyaki burger. Very saucy. I've gone for the shrimp, sweet chili, like shrimp burger. And then we've got some churros. The pudding. So I'm hungry, but I'm tired as well. I'm so tired. How snazzy is this hotel reception that we're staying at? This is the first hotel we're staying at. So we're staying in Tokyo for four days now to do Disney. And this is the Shiomi, Tokyo Bay Shiomi Prince or something. Looks lovely. Right, so we're in. So, room tour. You come in, take your shoes off. There we go. And you put your slippers on, as demonstrated by Michael oh, Bell. Good. He's just made me retake this video, and I feel like this is why. That's oh, defo why. So, I just found as well, in here, we've actually got pyjamas. I think that's like a little tote bag. There's laundry, if we need any laundry doing. I might get my travel stuff cleaned. Then we've got sink with little toothbrushes and toothpastes, hair dryer and towels. Then in behind this big long mirror, we have got, is that the light? The toilet. The fanciest toilet you'll ever see. And there's all the controls. Fl oscillate, I wonder what an oscillating is. Yeah, probably. Like sprinklers. Like sprinklers everywhere. Then in here, we have got a bath and a 
like a stand-up shower wet room style thing i'm buzzing i'm getting straight in that and after i've done this then this is huge when we booked hotels we were expecting for japan like tiny yeah. small boxes because well, that's all we that's, that's all we understood we got of the room was like double the size of anywhere else. Yeah. So then this, we've got bed. Nice size bed, actually, as well. I can sleep on here when you snore and steal the duvet. And then we've got big TV. I think that, is that a fridge down there? No, that's a dehumidifier. Dehumidifier? So what's this then? Fridge. Fridge in there. Kettle, ice bucket. I saw the ice thing on the way up here. What's that water? Yeah, that's natural mineral water. That's a coffee machine for pods. There's some pods down mm. there. Well, this is a bit posh. I wasn't expecting it to be this posh. It's alright to be fair, isn't it? I've even been got some like goodies, some toiletry goodies from in the reception they have these little sachets of them so i've got two shaving creams i've got two liquid cleansers i've got two face washes i've got two moisture lotions i'm assuming moisturizer and then two moisture milks I'm not sure the difference but we're gonna chill now for the rest of the night probably get an early one aren't we because we are at disney tomorrow and that's gonna be hectic it's gonna be a long day it is a lot of walking first day in tokyo has been a bit mental it's with the travel tomorrow, really, but we're here we're in and we're ready for the next two and a bit weeks so we'll take you with us and we'll see you in the next one Thumbs up from mine.